welcome to another episode of Checkout Basket. Today, we are checking out an item from Red Rooster that they've just released last week, which um, is supposed to be based on a chicken parmigiana. Now, here in Australia, we use slang. We abbreviate words like there's no tomorrow to make them longer, like other names that we just extend to make them shorter. I don't, don't like... I have no idea why we do it, but we do. And one of those things is we uh, change the name from a chicken parmigiana and we call them a parmy. Now, Red Rooster have decided to release a burger inspired by the chicken parmigiana called the chicken parmy burger. Now look, it comes in a nice little quaint little box. Nice. I do like the box idea because it's not getting squished with a wrapper like some other burger places do. This also allows the opportunity, when you do get them, you can actually tip your chips into the other side and, and, and you can have it all in a nice, nice little area. But today, we're doing the chicken parmigiana burger, or the chicken parmy burger, sorry, from Red Rooster. That's what the top of it looks like. Let's slip it out of its little box. Let's have a look. Side on. It looks, look, it, it, it's, it's not squished. It's a nice soft bun. That down. Let's flip this open and see what's inside. Oh, off comes the sauce. There we go. The marinara sauce. You've got a slice of cheese, your chicken, another slice of cheese, and underneath that cheese is creamy. I think that's mustard or cheese. Let's have a look. Oh, it's cheese. It's cream cheese. Ooh. That's nice. All right, put that there and whack this on top. Completes the burger. Put it back over. That's a, that, that's a nice burger. It's nice, it's not squished. Time for me and my knife. Oop. If I cut into it. go. Got through. Side view. Whoop. There we go. So you've got a chicken patty, your cheese, 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 and marinara sauce on top. Looks all right. Okay, now I've got it all over my hands. <laughs> it's time for you and me and my offsider to find out if this tastes all right. Taste test time! Okay, so in front of you is a palmy burger from Red Rooster, and the burger itself, just the burger, is $6.99. $6.99, so it's just under $7. Uh, just for a single. Now the doubled is more, uh, but we wanted to try the single first. So inside this burger, you've got uh, marinara sauce on top, which has got all those little herbs and spices in it, a slice of cheese, your chicken patty, another slice of cheese, and underneath that is cream cheese. It looks like mustard, but it's not. It's actually cream cheese. That actually looks quite delicious. Yes. It's a little bit messy. It made a little bit of mess on my hands while I was trying to cut this thing up. I saw you. I saw but you. It looked, and, and um, the chicken patty is quite thick. It's not like a skinny little thing. Oh, I just had to lift some off my finger and it's nice. Yes. All right. Oh, I've got a... It's it's cruising, it's cruising around because it's got sauce on both sides. It's going everywhere. All right, shall we go in for a taste test? Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Now, some people have been criticizing Red Rooster for their buns not being soft. Now, the Ripper Rolls are those, those hard baguette uh, rolls, so they are they are supposed to be hard. This is not a hard roll. This is a very soft bun. Like it was so soft, it was the, the knife was having a hard time getting into the into the top to cut it in half. That tastes nice. That is nice. It's that fresh. Is delicious. The mayonnaise on it is gorgeous. That's awesome. All right, shall we give it a score? 
Now this is this is a new item. It's been out for about a week. Like I think we got it late last. Uh, you got an email late last week saying these are these are up. Well, I tried the the Parmi nuggets. Yep. A little bit disappointed. I didn't think there was enough on them to really bring the taste. But this another kettle of fish. This is nice. It's juicy, soft bun, thick piece of chicken. Oh yeah. Oh, it's nice. Yes. And the score? Oh, I'm giving it a five. All right, that's good. Yeah, this one's getting a five. All right. Okay. So, um, look, I like it. It's nice. It's what they say it is. It's a little bit expensive for the buy buy the self burger. Although you can get these in a meal box with a drink and all that bits and pieces. I didn't want. I just wanted to get the stand price on the burger. Being almost $7, I'm going to have to give it a four and a half. It, ha it has, has to have half a point taken off for the price by itself. I'm just going on the taste. Now, although Red Rooster did send you a coupon to get one for free. Oh, yeah. But that, I think you're going to go for a double and get that, aren't you? <laughs> Try the double on that I've one. I've got to work out how to claim it. Yeah, there's a way of doing it. All right, well, you've given it a five. I've given it a four and a half. That's a nine and a half out of ten people. Just remember, if you've seen anything you like in these videos, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget any comments, questions, or things I could be doing better in these videos. Leave it in the comments field below. Maybe you've had the double. Tell me about it. Tell me what score you would give the double. Or even if you've had the single. Tell me what score you'd give it. Tell me in the comments field below. And if you haven't hit that subscribe button, hit that subscribe button and get notified when I do these. Check out Basket Episodes, my daily vlogs, opening for us, cooking with Craig, car maidens, you name it. I film it. It ends up on YouTube. So, hit that subscribe button. And until next time. See you in the next video. If you had the double, what would you give it a score out of? Same. Same? Yeah. Five? I'd have to see this height. See how big a double actually is. For well, if it's double the height of that... How, uh, how, yeah, how, how yeah, will they yeah. fit it in the box?